Hey Capricorns! What's up Cavies? Welcome to Horoscope-ish. I am Lindsay. This is for entertainment purposes only. If it resonates, hey! Just don't make any like life altering decisions based on a general tarot card reading online. This is really for the collective and if it doesn't resonate, don't try and make it fit. Because sometimes it gets a little not even seedy, but yeah, you're planting ideas. No, 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 no. If it's not your story, it's not your story. Um, so I saw panda bears all day yesterday and was like, what is going on? Like, I feel like I'm favored or something. <laughs> like, and um, it's just this, this panda bear is everywhere. It's making me so happy. So I'm using the way of the panda and doing a happy read. A little, a little like, just chill. Just chill. Panda bears are so chill. Like literally when they get bored, they just roll around. They just wobble around. Hashtag whatever the kid was. That's not my original sound. <laughs> um, really cute. So what do we have for Capricorn? Capricorn. Cappies. Cappy, cappy, cappy. Happy reaper. Ooh. your vibration. Capricorn's raising their vibration. Especially their feminine vibration. I feel like it's intuitive. Ooh! We've got this nine of wands here. Swords. Swords. So, there's a thought process here that's kind of scary. That's about having bad dreams. Having some bad dreams. And since this came up again, there was this, uh, sometimes when I go into a dreaming stage, even meditation, meditation most likely, or meditation mostly, um, to where if I see something in a vision that I'm like, oh, I want to go toward that, these suckers pop up. Not necessarily these, but like the same energy of like, what is that, you know? And in that vision, I was like, go away, I'm going over there no matter what and they dissipated. So this is all fear-based. <laughs> Root Chakra, Knight of Swords. All right, so you got conviction. You're having nightmares. And it's kind of making you think a lot. Oh, I've been there. <laughs> I have been there. Um, especially, you know, with uh, things that are really close to me. I mean, uh, man, my, my dreams went from uh, people being like, it's just a dream, to your dreams are crazy. And, oh, they're, they're, you're just dreaming? That's, that's what you're doing? You're dreaming? Um, yeah, but it does something in the daytime, does it not? Um, to where you're trying to figure things out. Why are we, like, being so involved with the devil here, Capricorn, with, um, some sort of mindset that, that makes you feel like you can't get out? Um, let's see. Oh, sometimes the panda, the way the panda is like, I'm done! I can't tell if that was a sneeze or somebody, like, overhearing me and giggling. Um, it's probably an overhearing giggle. <laughs> but it could sound like a sneeze, too. Um, oh, that's under the chair. Be right back. Okay, so. Oh. Nine of Wands. Oh. You're kind of obsessing over the way to approach something you really, 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 really want. Uh, even like putting on a show about it, you know? Um, being showy. I get so much more of a vibe of being like, um, I know this now. You know, you're not gonna keep me captive. I'm not gonna be a puppet. And then you go out and you're like, amazing. Oh my gosh, everybody loves a knight of 
of wands. Like it's just it just comes in to save the day, man. It's just like I'm here because my my creative path, my um the, what I bring to the table, it's awesome. It's awesome. It may not be fully developed, but it's definitely attractive. So, um and what I mean by fully developed is this is a night, you know? Maybe you have to act younger. <laughs> okay. If anything, you are fighting off those uh, old memories. Oh, I'm getting Nyad. Uh, I don't want to give it away. It's too soon. You gotta see Nyad. Same delivery. Got in your head, but there is a mission. Every time you get in your head, Capricorn, uh, maybe it stalls you from being a queen or a king of wands. You know, um, maybe it stalls you from some sort of, um, your thought process is stalling you from a big accomplishment. Um, fair enough. <laughs> I've been there. I'm a Gemini with a Virgo analytical crazy pants. Uh, part in my chart so <laughs> don't overanalyze communication like I do <laughs> or lack thereof um that's interesting I was like oh the way I wanted to push that out so we got the lovers major life choice the lovers Gemini energy speaking of communicating yet yeah, you're like my thoughts are crazy the truth is I just I just want to make you Notice me. Um, showy. <laughs> we show up, we gonna show up. Pulling that fresh out of the I'm too hot. Ah. The police and the fireman. Seriously? Now I'm getting you embody the lovers. Like, you're just a lover, Cappy. Oh my god, you're such a lover. You're such a lover. <laughs> I'm a lover, not a fighter. But if I do fight, <laughs> no one will question. No one will question. Capricorn doesn't get vulnerable and, like, say what they need to say because they're like, my, I pick my battles, like, uber choosy. Mmm, that's refreshing. <laughs> Seriously, I need to get some W. I can't even talk. Just slurring right out. Oh, did you did you need that? Um, I love this because it's a breath of fresh air. It's kind of like you've come to the edge. You've come to the edge, Capricorn, and you're like, what's that little boat? It looks like somebody made it. Someone's idea is floating by you. What is that? It's just this little newspaper boat. <laughs> I just went to it with it. I'm like, don't chase that boat. But it's not like that. <laughs> but you do see something that's like, oh, intriguing. And it's about moving forward. It's a little like, ugh, I've been on this path forever. Well, you've come to a source of water. And it is possibly a public bathhouse. I don't know, look the water. <laughs> Uh, there's an idea floating around. And you're like, ooh, I want to get on board. However, you are a panda. <laughs> Can't really get on that little boat. Like a small boat on the ocean. Sending big waves in emotion. Like how a single word. God, <laughs> not even the words. I'm sorry. But it's your fight song. You're still fighting, Cappy, okay? You're still fighting. <gasps> because you want to work with that idea. You want to work with what's that on paper. You want to work with that idea. Okay, okay, okay. So we're wanting to work with that idea. Oh, I almost thought that thing stopped. I was so nervous. You saw me get nervous. This is my nervous. <laughs> I'm all cards on the table, Cap, I swear. Um, Next to a Batsura shoot. <laughs> it's convenient. Oh. Okay, right now, giving it a rest. Mainly because you're trying to attain more knowledge. I just went so Midwest with that knowledge. I lost it though. 
Um, but I lost it somehow. Knowledge. You're giving it a break and doing some more research. Very studious as well. Lots of faith. <gasps> Aaron, look at this. Life change. Boom. Or a life moment. Where it's like, oh my gosh, do you have all the information you need? And look very equipped and very enthusiastic with those oh, wings. Hello. And yeah, you're moving forward into the unknown. You're like, well, <laughs> let's go. So there they go. There goes Cappy. You already know. You're using your intuition. You already know where you're going. And guess what? Where you're going, ooh, you're gonna get loved on. <laughs> you're gonna get loved on so much. Okay. I love you. Bye. <laughs>